Hello and welcome to this video where I'm going to be showing you how to write a blog post using AI, most specifically Jasper, which they come with a free trial and bonus. The link will be down below in case you'd like to follow along. You could do exactly what I'm going to be showing you. Now, a lot of people know Jasper for all their templates, their boss mode, but I'm going to be showing you a unique way to do this, which I happen to like as well uh, in terms of writing blog posts. It's very easy to do. We have four templates. We have our blog post outline. They're in different tabs. We have our blog post intro paragraph. We have our conclusion and the paragraphs that are going to be in between. That's all we really need. In fact, all we need to do is write our blog post or title topic. For this example, I'm going to be using golf tips for beginners, how to improve your game. I also have a Google uh, Drive sheet open or just Google Docs so that I can copy and paste the information that we get. So first and foremost, let's use this blog post outline. The outline that it gives us are going to be the subjects or like the headlines that we're going to be using where we can obviously fill those in later. So let's generate that AI content and see what we get. All right, so here we go. We got the basics of golf, what types of clubs you should use, how to read greens and putt correctly, uh, start by practicing air, learn the basic rules. These are actually both really good. I'm going to go with this one. They're both similar. They both offer different types of tips. Uh, give me a second. What I'm going to do is kind of delete and format this better. Okay, so here we go. What I did is just kind of made it look a lot better. So we have our original title, and of course, we have our H2s, which we're going to each use for all of our information. But before we do that, let's add in our intro. So we have our outline. Now we have our intro. Pretty much, we don't need anything else. We just need to use our title. So let's generate that AI content. So if you're new to golf, you've been playing for a while, but you're not seeing the results you want, then this post is for you. In it, we will discuss some tips that can help improve your game. So read on and start shaving strokes off your score. Not bad. Like it could be a little bit longer, but I'm going to go with that. Let's go back to our, this is where the intro is going to be. All right, perfect. And so now that we have that, all we need to do is write the paragraphs and the conclusion. So I'm going to save the conclusion to the end simply because it might come up with something that's related to these stuff we talked about. For example, if we're talking about golf swing tips and then it just comes to a conclusion where it talks all about putting, it might not match up as well. So let's go to the paragraph generator. And what we need to do is take each of these headlines. All we got to do is copy paste this in there. Keywords to include. Uh, let's just put swing just because it's related. And let's generate AI content. First step to having a great swing is by practicing your swing. You can do this in a number of places, uh, get a feel for it. Once you have it down, you can move to a driving range. Okay, so this is perfect because it's all about talking about in your backyard or a park. Once you get it down, then you can move on to the driving range. You can start hitting it. Perfect. This is directly related to what we want. So let's take this and that's where we're going to add it in. Next, obviously you can write more if you want to continue on, but I'm just going to go to the next one, paragraph generator. So let's replace this. Uh, let's just say rules of golf. I'm going to delete this because that's what we had last time. Let's generate that content. Okay, so golf is a game of precision and concentration. They must use the clubs to hit the balls. Before hitting the links, it's important to learn the basic rules of golf and how to keep scores. Otherwise, blah, blah, blah. The rules of golf can seem complex at first, but they are actually quite simple. For example, they are not allowed to do this. And of course, players must observe proper etiquette. So a good overview of why it's important to learn the rules. It's simple and so on and so forth. Obviously directly related. If you were looking for something more specific, you could obviously write more. But this is pretty much writing more about exactly what we told on about like why it's important to learn the basic rules, uh, the simplicity, and so on and so forth. Try different clubs, types of golf clubs to find the ones that work best for you. Let's copy this. Let's just do golf clubs. Let's remove this and let's generate content. So if you're new to golf, you might be wondering what all the fuss is about golf clubs. Do you really need a different club for every shot? The answer is yes and no. If you're just starting out, kind of just going through quickly, there's no one size fits all. For instance, uh, you tend to slice the ball. You might benefit from a club with more offset. Ultimately, it's important to experience to see what works for you. So don't be afraid to try out different golf clubs. Perfect. Remember, that's what it was about. Trying out different golf clubs and why you need to do that. Okay. Play with beginners to get comfortable with the game. Let's just say golfers, okay? Let's, all right, actually, before I do that, with the golf game. I forgot the fact that we knew it was about golf, but if I just didn't put golf in there and have golfers, that could have been about anything, okay? So let's make sure we're a little bit more specific. Let's generate AI content. 
When it comes to golf, there's nothing more frustrating than feeling like a beginner among a group of experienced golfers. You hit your ball into the woods for the upteenth time and so on and so forth, but golf is a game that anyone can learn with a little practice and so on and so forth. There's no need to feel intimidated when everyone is in the same boat or cart. You can focus on having fun, on working on your swing without worrying about keeping up with the Joneses. This is a really good one. I love the wittiness of in the same boat or cart. You know, golf cart, golf joke. So that worked out very well, especially with the wittiness that I added to it. Last but not least, okay, we got a, there we go. Take lessons from a pro to improve your skills even more. Once again, what I want to do is just add in golf because we know it's about golf. Like we're taking this from something related to golf, but until we put golf in there, now Jasper is going to say, okay, Let's just put golf here too. We don't have to do golfers. Uh, Jasper is now going to know that we're talking about golf. Otherwise, you can take lessons to improve your skills for basketball, for writing copy, for building your market, for personal training, for weight loss, for bench press, you know, whatever. Let's generate AI content. All right. So we got a lot here. So if you've been practicing, you're finally starting to get the hang of it, but you're still not quite there. A golf pro can help you with expert guidance and feedback. They can teach you etiquette. They can help you select the right club. So if you're serious, Perfect. Exactly what we want to talk about here. A lot of the benefits and the reasons. So now last but not least, we're going to have our conclusion. So what I can do is just do, and now we can go to our conclusion tab. All we need to do is add in the title that we already have, which I did. And let's create that content. Last thing. So if you're a beginner golfer who wants to improve your game, start by practicing the following tips. And remember, practice makes perfect. How do you practice golf? Do you have any other tips for beginners? Let us know in the comments below. It's funny, I put golfers forgetting it's a call to action and it still worked out very well. So uh, normally you do like, you know, leave a comment down below, assuming it's an article, right? Or any other action that you want to add. Let's delete this. Oh. S. Okay, so that was just a few like editing things. Uh, give me one sec. 905 words. Now, I wasn't doing that very quickly. It might seem like I was. I was skimming through, but that was, you know, I could have definitely got that done a whole lot quicker. But that's how you can really quickly create content, blog posts, articles using AI and Jasper specifically. And that's about it. I hope you got some value out of this. It's always fun to create articles using Jasper in this specific way where you can kind of use templates together using AI and Jasper most specifically. Don't forget that you can try them for free. They don't offer that on their homepage. So be sure to check the link down below in the description. If you click that, you'll get a very nice bonus as well. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below. And that's about it. Thank you so much for watching as always, and I'll see you in my next video.